Hey folks, day 30, I think we've hit a milestone. Hope you're having a good day today. Today I'm reading from the Gospel of Matthew, chapter 20. As Jesus and his disciples were leaving Jericho, a large crowd followed him. Two blind men were sitting by the roadside, and when they heard that Jesus was going by, they shouted, Lord, son of David, have mercy on us. The crowd rebuked them and told them to be quiet, but they shouted all the louder, Lord, son of David, have mercy on us. Jesus stopped and called them. What do you want me to do for you? He asked. Lord, they answered, we want our sight. Jesus had compassion on them and touched their eyes. Immediately they received their sight and followed him. What do you want me to do for you? Jesus asks. Of course, it's obvious. These are both blind men standing by the roadside. Yet Jesus still asks a very obvious question. It's not that Jesus didn't know what he needed to do for them. And it's not that they didn't know what he needed to do for them. But sometimes we have to state the obvious. We have to state our need, not because God doesn't know, but sometimes we need to hear it ourselves. What is it that we need God to do for us? Sometimes we have to come out and say it ourselves so that we know it deeply. Today, whatever it is that you feel like you need God to do for you, God already knows, but sometimes we don't want to realize it. But say the obvious. Admit what God needs to do for you, to bring you healing, to restore you to life. Our prayer today, Lord, taking on our flesh, you have made flesh holy. Help us to die to our selfish ways in our faithless habits, so that we might know the fullness of your new creation in our lives and our communities. Amen. May the peace of God be with you today. Have a good day. See you tomorrow.